A professional boxer is a set of multiple techniques, specific punches, and combinations as part of his defense and offense against the opponent. These combinations and techniques are what he has practiced and perfected repeatedly for months and years. In this video, we are going to look into one of those techniques applied multiple times by Floyd Mayweather. It's called pull counter. Pull counter involves a boxer to expect his opponent's punch, pull his head back to avoid getting hit, followed by a counter punch of his own. Here, Mayweather is expecting a jab from Marquez. He makes him miss by pulling his head back to avoid being hit, and immediately follows up by countering with his own right hand, and then ducks under Marquez's counter counter as he knows Marquez is a counter puncher himself. This is really smart. Watch more examples. The man who's training Louis Leha for this fight, Jesse Ravello, was an Olympic coach. Down goes Leha on a right hand over the top by Mayweather. Mayweather applied it multiple times. Roy Jones Jr. mentioned the mistake Mayweather's opponent was making. That was throwing a lazy jab. Lazy jabs make it very easy to apply the pull counter. Ten round fight. Release any punches. He's totally tentative and back on his heels now. For that reason, there's the third knock Mexicans and beating them in the identity of the Mexican assassin. Now, here's the first knockdown of the second round. That straight right hand again, Roy. Yeah, the Aleja uh, throw the lazy jab and Mayweather came right over the top. If that's the worst mistake a young fighter can make is throwing a lazy jab. Watch another example. Money Mayweather kept on using the same technique repeatedly and his opponent had no clue what was happening. Same to Endo when you jab. Cap following you around the ring trying to knock. Here's Mayweather with the right hand again. They're both talking. Is that going to disorient the fight? Oh, no, no, I think it's the best. The good part is in do, in do is a puncher, so he can get back in the fight with one punch. That's it. I don't think Floyd's worried anymore. about his punches anymore. That's it. Look right. Thing right. Snatches his weight back right on top. Put it back, Bay, get right on shoulder back. into it. Look at that. Then right over the ear, right, right, right in the face, right there. Seldom you'll see a fighter land three of the identical punches. He was open for your right hand all night long. Well, I pulled counter. That's a pull counter. That was one, two, and I think, and three. And, and, and one more. Three. Fighting four. The technique is not exclusive to Floyd Mayweather. The move has been applied by many professional boxers. Mayweather seems to have perfected it well and used it many times in the ring. Learning and practicing the technique does not make you smart enough. What you also have to know is to think, what if someone applies this technique on you? Let's see an example. Marcos Maidana was caught by Mayweather's pull counter. Chino was able to recognize that Smart boxers make adjustments right in the middle of the fight. It turned out the solution of this technique is simpler than one could have thought. A simple 1-2 or jab right hand combination does the trick. Watch in slow motion. Mayweather is expecting Maidana to throw one jab, which he can apply his pull counter on. He pulled back his head to avoid being hit, but Maidana was actually throwing a jab right hand combination, which got to Mayweather and totally rocked him. Don't forget to like and subscribe to support our channel. Let us know if you want us to break down more techniques and combinations by writing in the comment section below.